What's up guys, Moose here. Um, I wanted to make a video about this because I talked to a few people today and they had no idea that this even existed. Um, I'm sure a lot of you probably do, but for those of you who don't know, um, there's a much easier way than putting in like all your affixes on um, poe.trade, like manually putting them in and it's like quite easy to get to so I'm gonna show you real quick it's basically a faster way to search um, most searches take me like under 10 seconds so like step one basically is you like find whatever let, let's just say I want to find an upgrade for this wand or even let's just say I want to post this one for sale I want to find similar ones so you control C on it um, that copies all the affixes to you know your clipboard then you go to poe.trade you go to import item data and then you control V um, I normally do undercut uppercut and then I type in like 80 to 125 that basically what that does is all the stats that are listed here the stats of this wand it will multiply the values by 0.8 and 1.25 and it'll search between those values so you find more um, items so anyways, it says nothing was found, that's fine. So what I want to do is I want to delete, since I don't care about any of these mods, I don't care about the DPS of the wand, I don't care about its attacks per second, and I don't care about its PDPS. And then I don't care about, let's just say I don't care about mana on kill. I do care about implicit spell, um, the implicit spell damage, but I think what I want to do is, see there's a, there's a pseudo, a total, it searches for the total spell damage, so I want to get rid of this since I don't care about the implicit since it counts towards this total for spell damage. I'll get rid of that. I don't care about individual fire, lightning, or cold damage, and I really don't care about maximum mana. Let's just say we want to find um, an upgrade, and I don't care how high the spell damage goes. Um, level doesn't matter. We can search for wand as soon as I find it. Uh, I am completely blind. There we go. All right. Awesome. Okay, so anyways, um, <laughs> I'm back. So as you can see, I've got like all these wands now. I sort it by, I can sort it by, you know, price or whatever. But it's a really easy way to search for stuff. So like, I'll show you another for instance. Let's go back into PoE. Let's say I want to find an upgrade to, you know, this piece of armor. So Control C. And the wand actually, weapons take a little bit longer than most items because you have to like delete all the DPS and attacks per second and stuff. So we are going to search for armor, which might be a little easier. Um, nothing was found. Show search form. I just searched in the wrong league. We want it to be that the armor rating's fine. Um, we don't care about implicits because there's a total for both of those. Um, we want to uncap that, uncap that. There's a pseudo. Basically what pseudos are, if you're not aware, are um, they, they're the same thing is total they combine like I'm not sure why they list them differently but they combine different affixes so let's say um oh that's that might be the reason is because it combines different affixes into like one thing so for example for number of resistances we can make this like three that will give us three different resistances on that item so it will be from you know one to three for a total elemental resistance percent um this is for fire, ice, and um, lightning resist together. So it can have five cold, you know, six lightning, and five fire, and it would fall into this 16% range. So this is for all your resists. Um, this is for, that includes chaos, or wait, no, that doesn't include, this includes chaos, this doesn't, because chaos is not an elemental resist. We can get rid of that, get rid of that. And this is the same thing as that, except for it includes chaos as well. But anyways, I was just like explaining the difference between those. Um, you can also modify this cold. Let's just say we want to search for all resist. So we go to total resistance and this will search for chaos as well. Just type in 16, get rid of the cold and this will give us 16% of any resist or a combination of resists. That's what the pseudos do is, is combine different affixes. But anyway, so from there we just do a search. It will find us 
you know, lots of knee armor, then you can just sort by price. And that's it. So, you know, simple enough, but the um the import item data is really useful. You can, you know, if I wanted to find, you know, a higher armor, I could just delete that and it would just uncap the max armor that can find. I mean you can do so much stuff with it and it, it really does make your searching easier because I don't have to go through and manually put in each of these. And if I wanted to make it really simple, I could just delete the pseudos that I don't care about, the totals that I don't care about, and I could just leave the rest and just do a search. But um, it's very, very useful, and I talked to um, a few people today, and none of them had any idea that you could even search like this. So just wanted to give you guys a heads up if you didn't know. Um, appreciate you guys watching. Catch you later.